Hello guys, uh, this is Phil from Newbie Drone again. Uh, today, we're gonna introduce you um, these two little guys. These are for the um, Acrobi micro batteries, uh, 250 or 250 HV. So this is the Alcoda battery checker for one cell. You can see they have the, all the JST plugs over here. And this side is for Molex. This thing is pretty intuitive if you're flying uh, micro quads. Plug in the battery right here. So I'll show you the voltage. Isn't that awesome? And this guy over here is the Alcoda USB charger. And this thing is capable of charging regular LiPo one, one cell. 4.2 volts and it can also charge the high voltage ones so to demonstrate that let's uh, plug some battery in so here we are using the USB power from this ISDT D2 um, I believe this thing has four charging ports each of them takes uh, 500 milliamp and together they are drawing total of 2 amps so if you have a uh, let's say iPad charger or some Samsung tablet charger that has an output of 5 volts and uh, maximum more than 2 amps you can uh, charge 4 batteries at one time using this and plug it into the tablet wall adapter so but today we are using the D2 so the D2 has a USB port here it says the mm, it's 5 volts 2 amps it's the same as the um, tablet charger so let's plug it in Oops, this way okay so once we plug it in we can see the lights blinking in to the left direction so on here it's it has some arrows showing the HV 4.35 volts if we are in the HV charging mode the light should blink to the left which is uh, where we're at right now you can see the lights is moving to the left and here we have we have some um, HV batteries I'm gonna charge it in uh, let's put one two once you plug in the battery you can see the green light start blinking which means it's charging already and it doesn't matter if you plug in one two three or four you can plug in any batteries any number of batteries in there it can still charge them individually and right now you can see all four lights are blinking indicating we have all four ports working at the same time and once the charging has completed I'm gonna unplug this for now, just for demonstration purpose. And once the once the uh, charging has completed, then the lights will stay solid green. This one, this battery is charged, and I'm gonna plug it in and let it charge a little bit. You can see the the lights has been uh, solid green, which means the charging has been done. Okay, so how can we switch? from the HV mode to this regular LiPo 4.2 mode. So on the back, there's a little hole right here. All you need is to use a pin to press it down for three seconds. Okay, after three seconds, you can see the lights blinking in the opposite direction right here. It was blinking to the left for the HV right now after three seconds pressing the button the lights is moving to the right so we're ready to charge those regular one cell batteries that's it for the charger and this guy check it out this one is charged 4.35 and they are all doing their job pretty well Okay guys, see you next time.